Owen, a 2-1 win today against Bromley, you must have liked the result. Yeah, uh, really happy. Um, thought we played well for kind of long periods of the game. Probably made it difficult for ourselves in the, near the end of the second half, but really happy with three points and uh, just looking to move on to next week. Ben mentioned in his interview just then about the different conditions and the atmosphere that you come into here. How extra pleasing is that to get the results over the line with this one? 100%. Yeah, obviously, you know, it's, it's easy to kind of say you just have to get on with it, but it's a completely different pitch. And um, in a way, I thought it suited us a bit. We could we could play when we needed to play and, and do the other side of the game as well. So, um, yeah, it is different, but, you know, at this stage of the season especially, you just got to get on with it and, uh, and keep moving forward. What kind of extra preparation do you have to do for a game like this and this sort of pitch? Because, like I mentioned, it is different to what we face every other week. Not much, really, to be honest. Um, you know, you never really know what the pitch is like when you turn up to away games. So, could be could be completely different to, to what we've played on the week before. So, I don't think a whole lot of different preparation goes into it. I think the ball moves a bit quicker at times, but... You know, once you're, you're got your head around that in the warm up, you're okay. In the first half, we did have chances, couldn't quite make the breakthrough, but in the second half, Moors did what he does. Fortunately, he got four full scores in all competitions this season, he had a phenomenal record with eight games left. Incredible, yeah, incredible. I think, you know, I said to him at half time that, you know, we, we had the chances, but I think it's coming for him. And once I thought we once we once we got one goal, we get we get the second and proved to be the case. But, you know, his record speaks for itself. He's been, you know, I've only been here a month or so, but he's, he's been brilliant in every game I've been here. and. Um, it's just a credit to himself and, and everyone around him, I think, and you know, it's, it's, we're just so glad we have him in our team. And a couple of players went off injured as well, there's been some illness in the camp this week. How much has that proven today was a really about our squad performance? 100%. I think um, I've said that since I come in, you know, the dressing room is brilliant and we love doing doing extra work for each other. And you know, a few lads go down with illness and obviously we, we lose Leno in, in the first half, but I think we've just got that sole focus on, on getting through it for each other and, and helping each other and that's a, that's a huge, huge uh, factor for us. I suppose that is the, the real strength of this squad that everyone fights for each other despite the competitiveness in the squad, everyone has that same goal. Yeah, I think that's a really big, big, big thing that I've seen since I've come in, you know, everything we do is for each other here. We, we play for each other, we run for each other, we do the extra yards for each other and you know, like you've said, cases like that, it's, it just it just shows up it shows up again when, when we really need it. And a goal again today came from Tosa's long throw, just shows that diversity we've got in the attack as well. Yeah, I think you know that's an unbelievable weapon to have. Um, I think you can throw it further and I can kick it, so it's a, yeah, it's, it's an unbelievable weapon. I think we've taken advantage of it so far quite a lot of times this season and um, hopefully we'll do it a bit more.